yellow welcome back to sword and sorcery super brothers sword and sorcery ep let's see what kind of world ending we can do today Book. Book. play session three Typically requires a lunar month to complete. Alright. Tamed the Golden Trigon, and the storm has miraculously lifted. Consult the Megatome and study its working, should you become lost. Deathless Spectre still lurks in the darkness beneath. Consider the cosmic geometry of the Trigon Trifecta. Observe the moods of the moon. Our research shows that social... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Be advised that henceforth we will be monitoring your inputs in relative silence. So I'm guessing it's saying the tutorial is over. Essentially. Uh, the heck? We groggily awoke from a super deep sleep with no firm recollection of what had happened. Reminded of the miracle in the meadow in our encounter with the Golden Trigon. Totally floored at how awesome and crazy the fight was. Wondered about how maybe the gold trigon might be connected to the grim mysteries beyond the iron gate. Didn't dig grim mysteries, so he chose to go home and chop wood. Alright. Can my character, um. Oh. We're all kinds of messed up. Yeah, can we not? No, we can't. Okay. Bright moon in 12 days. So I was trying to do. Okay, now it's doing it. Okay. Um, let's, uh, Eat a mushroom. Hey, and that brought us into a... Into li oh, giant music disc. Interesting. Okay, I just want to see if we could go up there. We cannot. Oh. Mysterious. Secluded grove with a collection of strange stone structures. Was this the Trigon Grove? We stood beside the first stone structure we thought of Golden Trigon, we felt our sword stir. Stand here, my dude.
I guess even though our sword is stirring, there's not much we can do about it. Oh! There is much we can do about it. We did a thing. We're geniuses. The game's right, for real, for real. I was thinking the same thing, my dude. Okay, we created a circle. Let's um, mess with this first. In the Trigon Grove, beyond the cavernous cave, in the meadow, we approach solitary grave and we met with the glowing ghost dude the glowing ghost dude in the trigon grove totally freaked us out at first to be honest he recognized our scythian garb and he saw that we carried the megatome he wondered if we understood the esoteric markings inside in a whisper he spoke the name of the deathless specter we had awoken in the darkness beneath Gogolithic mass. We knew the dreadful name from the old stories, and we felt our blood run cold. Up until now, I had the feeling that the Gogolithic mass saw you as a bit of a tourist. Now that you've learned the song of sorcery and tamed the Golden Trigon, you will find your every step is haunted. We couldn't tell if the glowing ghost dude was cheering us on or psyching us out. We told the ghost dude of our intention of deton to detonate the megatome atop and release the gogolithic mass from immortality. We asked about the trigon and trifecta and the locations of the remaining two, but his response was irritatingly obtuse. Exists only in the dreams of the mountain folk. Locate the remaining two trigon is not so much a question of where as it is when and how. The glowing ghost dude sure did talk a lot of unhelpful nonsense. I kind of get it though. We gotta go into somebody's dream at some specific time. Doing that one, just do this. So it got multiple options for that. up here. Hmm. Yeah, it's too late to worry about that now. So I'm guessing we need the other triangles to worry about this. I doubt I doubt this does anything. Hmm. 
It's also possible we didn't do this quick enough. So let's try going to one and then immediately the other. And then we'll move on and assume that's not the case. Okay, so that's not going to work. Yeah, so I'm assuming it just means that I haven't found it. So let's let's go find one of the villagers. Of course, first I want to boop boop. All right, one second. I need to uh, <laughs> fix something. I'm just trying to This. Yes. Do that. Oh, well, y'all can't see it. I'll check this anyway. Yep. Okay. I'm back. That incessant beeping should be stopped now, <laughs> so we can play the game in peace. The woods beyond the meadows, has someone run the secrets of the Charagon Grove? That doesn't help us. We are really worried about the Scythian, she disappeared for days after the storm lifted, I sure hope she's okay. So no, nothing important. Let's go talk to girl. We asked her about secrets of the grove. How the dreams of her people help many mysteries and how they reflected the moods of the moon in strange ways. Told us to sit by the hearth in the stone hut at any time, either to go dreamwalking or to gather strengths. Dealing with the remaining two trigons might be lost in dreams or something like that. Well, yeah, I got that bit. Ooh, 
Woodsman known as yeah had to return to his wood chopping. Seems to be really digging it. An old story people typically told their children to freak them out. Of a posse from Scythia who had come seeking Trigon Trifecta in these forgotten mountains many moons ago. They'd learned to seek Sylvan sprites and send them all skyward, and then they had sought a location to enact a miracle. Hope to activate the three skyward beams in the Trigon Grove, but they had no idea where or when the Trigons were. The posse wandered aimlessly for a long time. They were weary, so they stopped. Suddenly killed by a deathless specter. Ugh. It's a nice story, but actually it didn't freak us out all that much. Uh, Suddenly words. Okay. Let's uh, try to go inside a room. My first guess is that the dream changes depending on what night it is. And whose dream it is. Just jumped off the cliff. Well, I guess we're going to follow him. Let's grab this mushroom real quick first. as far out as we can go. Believe. Yep. Well, alright. This is definitely not what I expected, but I'll take it. well-worn dream space there are new places to explore new connections to consider if you continue to believe it's dreams you realize who you've imagined you are but to identify with the dream is to become bewitched to co-create with it instead of fighting resisting and cursing it you crossing the threshold of liminality is a simple matter warm hearts okay 
So we're just going to keep following the guy. I'm assuming that's what it wants us to do. I haven't seen any sprites or anything like that, so I assume it's just keep following him. Hmm, it's another face. Ish? It's another face ish. Alright. it is Ooh. okay Just one more. There we go. Die, fool. I don't care. Badass ghost showed up to sing. That's a mad rhyme. He did, did he? Monitor the moods of the moon and you'll learn when to be, where, and how. Also, I just want you to know that I am not deliberately trying to spook you by looking so awesome like I do. <laughs> okay. Special place that will always go. A parliament of trees at the heart of the world. Titanic hollow tree. She got us long since dead who predates mankind by told eons. Of course, I'd never tell people about these goddess tree dreams because they probably just call me a hippie. The grizzled boar has been slain. Do you know anything about this? I should mention the grizzled boar was included in... S and SEP to tempt participants into identifying as violent sociopaths. Not that I'm suggesting that you are <laughs> a violent sociopath. Sure, you had your reasons, right? I imagine you might be wondering what that key is for. To be honest, I have no idea. I have an idea. Can I leave? I can't. Okay, let's explore first. Oh yeah, I know where we're at. Because this is... Yeah, because these are the birds where we close them and this was this. It's just not here anymore. Maybe because we're in the dream. Let's uh, pick the 
this up first. Don't read it, just go ahead. Hmm, weird. Back to the A side. Well, let's go do the thing then. Since we probably finally found the key. I don't remember exactly where the door is, but I think it's just up here. Um, we're going to check this grave out real quick. I know nothing's probably changed, but it's not that far away from the main path. Oh, here we go. So this stuff actually, because probably we got the one thing. A few ghosts who seem friendly. The glowing ghost who spoke was a giant we knew from the old stories whose famous portrait demanded obedience. For the Yuletide I assembled a posse, we set out to reassemble the Trigon Trifecta. Part about the gateway to the infinite, about the summit. We thought it sounded like something cool to see. We came to Golden Trigon and scoped out the Trigon Grove before setting out to locate the Bright Moon Trigon. Getting the Bright Moon Trigon did go so well, we got totally lost, to be honest. <laughs> Slowly we realized the significance of the lunar cycle and its influence on the sprites who slumbered in the twilight realms. That's when we sat here and began to monitor the moods of the moon so we might learn when to be where and how. We died of boredom. We died because of an argument we had because of boredom. Was that one of our posse was a cheating cheater and we caught him red-handed. Fight broke out and the cheating cheater fled up the old road towards the perilous precipice. We're just hanging out wondering what to do and all of a sudden the gogolithic mass showed up. Yikes. Oh, hey there, bud. Fine, I guess. Interesting and weird at the same time.
This is the door I think we're supposed to be going to. Yeah. I'm a genius. Okay, so this is how we change. This is how we change with uh, cycle the moon is in. Hey, Mary. How's it going? Long way from zero to one, and if an alien said hello, it'd be a cryptic code on the stereo. <laughs> I'm half convinced that uh, this woodsman is just gypsy. <laughs> oh, nothing much. I'm just playing this game. Getting attacked by evil spirits and changing the mood of the moon. Boy. Alright, I guess we won't bite. Tipsy can hear me? Okay. This guy keeps making like song puns and then saying, wait, what? <laughs> so I'm convinced it's just Gypsy. Hey, Gypsy. This way. We have to stand still in a bubble stream for five minutes straight. <laughs> Why is that an achievement? That don't make no sense. Rather than something somebody would be like, oh yeah, that's cool, it sounds like just a, a waste of time achievement. I eat the mushrooms just for funsies. Meow, 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 meow. 
So if I go back this way. And I believe in the heart of the cards. Is there something new over here? I don't think it's trying to get me to mess with all the animals, although that's possible. Um, I haven't gone to the sides of this thing, so I'll do that first. No, I think it's just chilling here. Okay. Let's try this side. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is how I wake up. We Into the tree we go. Oh, I realize. You can actually go up here. I'm done. And commit them. Oh, this also just leads us here. That's good to know. It's a shortcut. Into the tree. So no, being here does not change anything when we change the moon, at least not with this moon, maybe another moon. What's this? Well seems unwell. Dream walking, but when I do, I tend to revisit my favorite places to see what has changed. Same woods, different weather. To think the case may be. So that's supposed to be a hint of sorts. I parted. I want to eat this mushroom so that I can pick this one up because it keeps flashing weird colors. Not that I think it's special, but... Hmm. I don't see anything different. So let us go back inside. We give this man a bro hug and then we wake up. It looks like the moon is back to how it was before. Uh, 
I don't know if I can double check that. Doesn't seem that anything has changed. Okay, well then let's go up the mountain before we uh before we go back and check the moon in the uh, special moon place. Just because I know there's more graves up there, so we can talk to some ghosts. Maybe we need to actually successfully beat the guy here. After we talk to these guys. At the very least, I want to try it. That's where the moon is. We want to go this way this time. So either we miss something when we change the phase of the moon or we have to change it more. But first we talk to Mr. Ghost. Purchase a solitary grave of the cheating cheater and an old glowing ghost dude. So the Yuletide, Andre the Giant, assemble the posse. <laughs> really, Andre the Giant, assemble the posse? Okay. We assemble the trigger. Mm -hmm. Other dudes in the posse are buried in the thicket to the side. Yeah. Kate and Tame the Golden Trigon. Totally stuck after that. Bright moon trigon. So we decided to sit around and watch the sky waiting for the moods of the moon to change. With these days, the bright moon loomed overhead. Jive suckers to wander aimlessly while I dug deeper into the moon logic trickery. Spoke of how we had cheated by quitting out of it and then <laughs> altering his computer data and time settings process was, but he told us that it allowed him to affect the basis of the moon. <laughs> Serious case of the heebie-jeebies pretty much ever since I cheated, and that's why I died of shame. Alright, I die of shame too. Nothing. Thought he's gonna be a bad guy. Can I? There we go. I can't. No, I can't. I can't re extend the tongue bridge. RP, RP. Shh. 
so it's definitely something to do with having the right phase of the moon. What does this say? Indecipherable lunar pictograms for to a secret place where the moods of the moon could be altered. Oh, yeah, I got that, but I was hoping it would tell me what phase I needed to be. Either that or it's just the one phase that I'm done. You can't just sit there and continuously change it. I think you can, though. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Dream time? This man again. Let us fight. Amazing warrior. Nobody can convince me otherwise. <laughs> Jock, get your bubble stream done. Let's start to haunt him. Haunt the heebie jeebies when the bright moon moons in the sky above and when the dark moon rains. like a coliseum. It's so weird that randomly in game they start talking. Just wondered how long it would be until the bright moon loomed in the sky above. Hmm. 
So potentially I need to either have a bright moon out or uh so full moon or a new moon. So that that guy is scared. When we go into his dream? That, or I should explore the open world a little bit more. We're going to look around as far as we can find this time. There was a met a mysterious fellow hanging out beside a crackling fire. Okay. Had this little song in my head for ages. Just a few little notes that loop over and over again. Good night since the storm lifted, I've had the same dream where I'm wandering in the woods in the hour before dawn. It's the same place and spaces except for when it differs according to the moods of the moon. The thrilling stillness when the moon is brightest and the moon is darkest and the woods are wild. Uh, so if I become a homicidal maniac... No? No homicide for me? Oh, no homicide for me. Okay, so it's not got to do with the animals. I was wondering... Oh, something's happening. Maybe because we met that guy? Maybe he just appears sometimes. I think him banging his shield is how many times he's going to attack. Then of course him raising in the air is just uh, when I got a shield dodge. These are here once again.
Check inside the tree. If nothing's changed, which it doesn't appear to have, then we will go around this way and see if anything's changed. Uh, in this little open world. different than the other one at least. Not yet. We're about here. Okay, so it's not saying that this is six this time though. Which I'm assuming means there's something else that's different. Question is, what though? This maybe maybe I'm just seeing what I want to see. Yeah, I'm probably just seeing what I want to see. Okay, so let's try and do big, big, big moon phase shift. Seeing as this is not doing to do much for us. Got us a little music man, but not sure what that actually does for us. Bro hug. What do you two think about this situation? Today is the start of a whole new lunar month. Looking forward to a long day sitting on rocks. It's 
spoke of his dream walking in the woods the hour before dawn under a crescent moon. He spoke of a creature he had met. Someone or something both strange and nude. Was it a bear, a man, or a grizzled boar? Seems like you're having a good adventure. I think I'd be able to tell the difference between a bear, a man, and a grizzled boar, but maybe that's just me. I'm not sure why it zooms in on the moon for that. Fight me, nerd. So we're going to go with a new moon. Because I have a feeling that that's the one that's important. Okay, so that's a full moon. Interesting. And then of course it goes the other way. So it does a full moon cycle, it doesn't like half ass it. Which is nice. The new moon of doom. Something else I could check is if the phases of the moon affect what the ghosts say, maybe?
Boom. Get slaughtered. Because I know it doesn't affect what the ghosts say in the dream, but it doesn't necessarily mean it won't affect what the ghosts say in reality. We'll see if uh, it does. You make me commit boredom. Run away! Run away! Who do they talk for? See what these two got to say. Sheltered from a thunderstorm in a hollowed out chunk of the titanic tree. We totally knew which titanic tree she was talking about. Okay. So what they say is also affected by which moon phase it is, I think. Unlike the ghosts. That or you can just keep talking to them. Ooh, it's raining. And it's dark. I assume that means I did something right. Try seeing if this guy's still over here first. He's not. Good. Nothing ominous about the song. Definitely not a total fucking 
bang, you're about murder. Oh, sun's gone. I was jamming there for a second. Oh, new jam. Oh, here we go. Let's commit music. Fucking love the sound of those fairies. The dark moon rains, and we just woke a Sylvian sprite in Candubros, the far side of the lake. I don't see one here. Oh, nope, there's one right there. Hell yeah. So it's this one. We have to figure out which one's next. that one. So it's this one specifically, this, this first one. Oh, okay. There we go. There we go. Pure luck and chance, but we still get to hear our beautiful little fairy sounds. Sprite surrounded by five waterfalls. Maybe it was time of miracles. Where my miracle at? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. The book wants to tell us something. What you got, girl? Sounds like all the Dark Moon sprites have been sent coward, so it's time for miracles again. I adore miracles. Sometimes words just sound like noise, but other times noises make pretty sounds. Okay, what's dog gotta say? Bark bark. The whirling infinite at the summit awaits you. Only the Trigon Trifecta will allow you to understand the secrets of the Trigon Grove. Only the end of your woeful errand will bring peace back to all our lives. That's deep, dog. That's deep. I'm glad you could get all that across with Bark Bark. Okay. Assuming in the tree. No. I 
Ah, ah. We're supposed to be outside, and then we sing our song of magic tune. Okay. I guess that's that then. Boy. Let's go on to the next boss. So it's just like the first one, at least in the beginning. Although the ball seems to be getting redder with each bounce, or maybe that's just my imagination. I think that's just my imagination. Filthy rainbow. Okay, that wasn't the answer, but uh, we'll assume we're good. We keep going. I see, not all of them were glowing. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. Missed the dodge timing. Because <laughs> I thought I uh, still had more whacking to do. Deep breaths. We got this, we got this.
Alright. Oh, it's the weird rainbow thing. Still don't know the answer to the rainbow. to the rainbow. Okay, good. <sighs> Got him. We have mastered geometry. into my book. Got the Dark Moon Dragon. That also took away one of our hearts, though. Once again. You have retrieved the Dark Moon Triumph. It's remarkable news indeed. Despite the scarcity of useful information we have provided, you have managed to master the Dark Moon Trigon. So now the question is, what's next? Remember that play a role in the outcome of this experiment. You may have encountered the Dark Moon Trigon's loathsome rainbow attack. Slice at that rainbow as hard and as fast as you can. Despite everything, we got it. The light and sound subside. We found ourselves rain soaked and cold amid a parliament of trees. We were feeling a little worse for wear. It was probably something to do with those cosmic laser bolts. Also, carrying around the megatome all over the place is kind of a pain, but it really is a burdensome book in more ways than one. Alright, assuming this isn't changed on the inside. No, it's literally the same. Ooh.
back to the daytime. Or the A side. Let's talk to these two before we get out. Uh, let's also turn in the Trigon before we get out. Dark Moon Trigon, and our intentions to reassemble the Trigon Trifecta. Told her about how he had smashed the Dark Moon Trigon's loathsome rainbow attack, and she was all like, cool. She didn't seem to mind listening to our crazy stories. Morning. Could see that our dream walking and miracle working had taken a heavy toll on our physical health. Asked us if we visit the dog fella in the Trigon Grove. Perhaps we could activate another sort of guy would be. I definitely remember 100% where the beams were. Yeah, I do. Because they were in here. Let's go, Pepper. Alright, don't know what that means, but we're going to go figure it out first. Pet. After activating another skyward beam, the Trigon Grove, we noticed something peculiar about the dog, known as Dogfella. It suddenly seemed we understood him. He urged us to seek the Bright Moon Trigon and complete the Trigon Trifecta. Okay. I will, doggo. Or at least I will in the next one. Sixty-seven <laughs> percent. Pretty good, pretty good. I will see you guys later. Thanks for being here. Bye-bye.